Hi, this is Cecilia from Tarot by Cecilia, and today is Saturday, May 28th, 2016. The tarot card for today is the Tower, and this is a Disney one. You know me, if the, if the card has this ominous feel to it, I need to keep it light, and, you know, so that's, that's what I'm doing here. But, you know, I don't feel like this is a bad Tower at all. You know, the Tower can be very, very good. Sometimes these drastic changes are so, so necessary. And, you know, it, it's good. Like, a lot of times you're going along, you're going along. Yesterday you had that, uh, you know, Ten of Wands, all right? And I kind of feel like when you have the Tower following the Ten of Wands, all right, most of the time the Ten of Wands is depicted as, you know, this person carrying this heavy load, you know, trying to get to their destination. Just think of the towers coming along and just blowing that load up, right? See, I told you, positivity, okay? Something can really come in and you can be enlightened today. You can have something revealed to you, which really can actually help you. Maybe it doesn't help you today, but you may suddenly hear something which you're like, oh my God. I could do that? Really? Oh, I, I didn't know. Wow, that changes everything. Okay, it's that kind of a thing. It's, it could be like a, a flash of something in a moment that you suddenly find something out. And you're, you know, feeling like you're get, actually getting away from. Okay, so this is not bad by any means. There are times that one can see the tower and go, oh, we've seen it and many lives sort of imploded. Everything crumbled to the ground and you had to sweep it all away and start fresh. And a lot of you are working on rebuilding now. But this one, this one's really here to help you because it's kind of been like you've been stuck, all right? A few days ago, we had that Four of Pentacles. That, that Four of Pentacles is just like being there and holding on to that position. I think this tower is meant to shake you loose from that position, okay? In a very good way. What is it that you need to do? What is it you need to break free from? What is it that needs to just change, all right? It's coming. You're going to know about it. it it's going to happen. And I always think, especially with these major ones, that a lot of times the... You know, the energy is in play for a couple of days. Now, also, I mentioned yesterday, Mars went back into Scorpio. You know, it's making its way back, and it's going to go direct on June 29th. That's like our target date. We have a few days in between that are very important. Obviously, the solstice, and we have June 8th, June 12th, dealing with Mercury. So, you know, this shaking up that's happening right now, it's shaking things up in a good way. I really think it's time because to get to June 29th, June 30th, the beginning of July, whatever, and to feel like you're at the beginning of something, you have to have some things shaken loose, right? There has to be some drastic change in here somewhere. Something has to give. So this is like, that something gives, something takes place. Maybe it's not the one thing that you're hoping for, but I think it's big enough to show you that, wow, oh my goodness. Like I'm telling you, you're going, that just happened? Okay, <laughs> I'm ready for whatever comes next. It's an amazing, amazing feeling. So, uh, I'm not looking for the uh-ohs in the comments or anything else. You know, this is, we're talking positive change coming, people. You know, sometimes it manifests itself in the oddest of forms. And right at the moment when it happens, it may catch you off guard. And you may not see the positivity in it. Stay calm, okay? Because you will. And you're going to go, okay, all right. I think I can deal with this. It's a big, big Thing. So, I want to say one thing real quick. Um, I don't get to mention it often enough, 
I noticed that so many of you, you know, tag your friends, share these posts. I can't thank you enough for doing so, all right? I love seeing all the newcomers and meeting everyone and, you know, trying to really just keep up with y'all. It's a, it's a pleasure getting to know you. So I want to thank you all for listening, and I'll see you here tomorrow. And as always, have a great day.